cables, XLR cables. These are different accessories and different things for all of them. And it looks quite good. I just need to kick all them cables in. And that's it. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. How are you doing today? What I need to do is I need to, I need to mark it somehow with, I don't know, something, a pen, pencil, anything. What is this? It's a marker. figure out a way of cutting it and the problem I have is that my saws and stuff just might not do I don't know if, if a if a straight saw or uh, I don't know what the best way to do it this would be maybe with this maybe I can cut it with this bad boy oh cuz you know what <gasps> I just remembered I have a saw blade for this. I've never used it. I believe, I believe it's still in my house. Let me go check. Oh, um, it don't fit. The diameter is too small for my device. So what I'm gonna try to do is just lay it on its side and try to cut it, I guess. I don't know. We're gonna see what happens. Gonna be interesting, I know that damn much. I don't, I just, I don't think this is gonna work. But fuck it, we're gonna find out. Well, that didn't work. Plan B. All right, now plan B is a lot dangerous because we are going to try to cut it. Okay, successfully cut it. Okay. Let's see if I can finish it now. Whew. I got it. I got it. We're good. Okay. We are not good. That is so crooked. Oh my God. Look how crooked it is. Shit. That's it's like it's too crooked. Huh? Too crooked. Alrighty, so Cause see once I secure it I can just go back along with the saw and clean up my edges So that's not a problem there Let me see here Let's get this sucker pulled back up Okay, so 
what I'm going to do is I'm going to ahead and secure it to the back with some screws. And then all of this excess that you see that goes around it, what I'm going to do is just come back through with the saw and clean it all up. And then once it's cleaned up, the inside's going to look good too. But we just got to, you know, we just got to finish doing what we're doing to it. And then we'll get to the sound. Finish that project. Now, y'all got to help me here because I'm not sure where I'm going to do with all this stuff. See, I got to have... I cannot fill this area up because once all this stuff is cleared out of here this is going to be the area that the camera goes in and out of so I can't exactly clean or put anything over here so I'm thinking that because see once I replace the camera gear and stuff then I won't need this anymore but I don't know what to do with this one because this these are a lot of help they really work good so I'm not sure here I guess I'll figure it out here in a minute. I think I got my spot picked out, but I I don't exactly like these either. And I'd like to do something with that as well, but I don't know. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna fit it here, clean up the mess, secure it to the back wall so it doesn't move, and then just start putting camera stuff in it. I would like to run some LED lights in it, so that way there's plenty of lighting in it. So I think that's what I'll do next out some LED lights that looks good all right so we'll just get us one of those and let's see here oh those are really bright these work very well I just uh, I don't have the patience right now to wire these up so I think maybe I'll do that for a later video um, and then this is also an LED light that I can install somewhere we'll see but we'll, we'll see if this works first we'll go with this and then I have a LED strip right here that I'm going to run along the inside and then mount this light somewhere and we'll go from there okay just feed it up through there like that great it's dirty just what I need dirty inside crap hola it's just one thing after another where's my duster at give me my duster duster nomadic okay thread it so we'll run it up through there Oh, I still got quite a bit of length, so I, mean, I guess I can run it this way too. So we'll just uh, let's just see how that looks here. We'll get it to semi stick because I know it won't, but if I can get it just to kind of hold. Okay, so we got the LED strip threaded through, ran down through here to here. And then it's down here and then what I can do is, is I can just I can run the cable for it out that way the power line to it and then this strip can just stick like this and maybe what I'll do is I'll take some tape some clear scotch tape or something and I can uh, I can scotch tape it and you never see it so okay got the LED so I got the LED ran now I got to do is secure it Okay, so we got the RGB light in, and we can actually adjust the, the brightness of it, and we can adjust the colors too, but I like, no, not that, I like the blue, the blue looks good. Uh-uh, no. Nope. Yep, that's what we want. Nope, it's not what I want. The color. Alrighty. Okay, so we got that installed. Now what we gotta do is get this little light installed. This is my other little RGB light. OK, 
take and what I'm thinking about doing is mounting it about right there that will probably be sufficient and we'll use some double-sided tape good to go so as you can see I installed an LED light right there so this will shine up nice and then the RGB light that runs in there good only thing I have to do is just put all the stuff in hide the cables run them out through the back and we're good to go guys now I just need to put all my stuff in and we'll be set there you have it guys that's basically what it looks like and how it's going to look like it gives me much more room for more expansion I can put more lenses different types of cameras I got my GoPros and then some of my audio and video stuff power cables XLR cables these are different accessories and different things for all of them and it looks quite good I just need to kick all them cables in and that's it so it just shuts like so there you have it just like that and then when I want something I just open it up and that's it so yeah that is my new camera cabinet RGB camera cabinet maybe that's what I'll call it be a good thumbnail or a good clickbaity deal the only thing I need to do now is deal with all this foam because they sent me a lot of it like a couple black boxes of it so yeah I need to deal with that now so anyway all right guys I'm out of here thank you so much for watching I appreciate y'all make sure to subscribe check us out on Facebook and patreon and as always you guys be cool and I'll see y'all next time peace